Yo, what's up? This be Blitz right here. Um, got some releases for you on the MW3 name mod for you. Now I got some few questions that some people have been asking. Like, Big Burrito says, it is giving me an error. It says I have to install .NET for Framework 5, whatever. What do I have to do? Oh, you see here, Big Burrito. You go to Google and you type in .NET Framework 4.0. Click Enter. And you click the first link. And you download it and install it. Wow, what a fucking concept. Alright, so, since you got that done, let's see anybody else here. Uh, yeah, there's another thing. Uh, I know that's what I did, but when I activated it, it came up as 18 name 19 can you explain how to activate uh, well basically some asshole called let's see if it's in there I think it was X liquify or something like that some assholes like told everybody the wrong information on how to fucking do that you don't actually put 18 into the string the 18 is a button location which is kinda not a string so don't put in the numbers that you don't want the string to be. Uh, let's see here. Nah, that's pretty it. Pretty much it. Um, there is this guy called Snipes Hacks, who is pretty much the only person who gave me credit on whoever made this, which would be me. And so I gave him a thumbs up, and yep. So this is a shout out to you. If you could, please sub him and sub me if you'd like to. You don't have to. Most people want you to sub them. But it is whatever. Alright, so whenever you do download it, I'll have the link in the description. You load it up. And you wait for it to load all its modules. Which, it's freezing for now for some reason. Don't know why. The fuck? There it goes. Okay, so it says it's loading. You wait for it to load. And, yeah. So then you go to MW3 Add-on. And this is where all your buttons are. You got some new ones. You got some blue arrows. Pressed R. Pressed minus. All that stuff. Now, the press plus right here, it will not have a preview because I do not have one at the current moment. From now till at, when I actually post this video, if I do get a plus button, I will add it into the program. But other than that, it's pretty much the same thing. You enter your name right here, which will be some random whatever. Um, then you can add your colors right here. Now, this is something you also the add return line. That will make your name go one line below. So you can have it like, say, like put be put around someone else's no name or something like that. Now, also, you can click the donate button right here, which would be awesome sauce for me because I like money. And it would go to a great cause toward this program. And so you just click it and then you put all your information in there. But I won't get into that right now. Okay, so program is made by me. It does have links code manager in it. Uh, you can create a text file with this. Uh, basically just ask you where you want to save it. I'll save it to my desktop. Let's say, call it fuck. Fuck. Oh, that's uck. Fuck. There we go. And it will save to the desktop right there, fuck.txt, and there it is. All right, so then after you make sure all your name is whatever, you click preview. It should look good. If it does not, please complain on the comments. Then after that, um, you go to codes and choose your profile. Now, it depends on which profile you want to choose because there is Black Ops and MW3. So I'll do MW3 for the sake of time. Also, the colors just reminded me. You can go to color settings and change it to whatever you want. I suggest not doing this because you need to do the background first because it's a pain in the ass to find it after all that shit. So after that, you just refresh all this shit right here. And there you go. And I will have to fix this differential button whatever right here before I do post it up online. But before that, let's go to MW3 and let's use the Wiimote. 
again you click replace then after that you got all your code tours in right there you go to create.txt it creates a text you can save it as fuck2 if you'd like click save and it will come up right here now this will come up right here which will help you create the .gct that will help you um, use it actually in game so you go open it on your desktop which where you saved it at basically Let's see if I can find it here there it is fuck2.txt and everything is in order so you click check right there and you go to export to GC uh, save it to I'll just save it to my drive store stored it and then you can go to your SD card just my USB drive right now and there is your GCT at under codes it's under codes just make sure you know that and it's C7E52 you will have to change that um, for the MW3 I don't know if I'll change that or not depending on how lazy I am but other than that, yeah. Uh, let's see what else I need to cover while we're on here. Um, other than that, if you have any questions or you have any errors like that, please tell me because it would help my coding abilities and it would also help you from not getting these weird fucking whatever messages. Uh, other than that, uh, see you guys later.